What's up guys, it's your boy Damon, and welcome back to another New World video. I, I damn, it's been a little while <laughs> since I was able to say those words, because we've been fighting COVID and all that stuff. Uh, I was going to come back a little bit, you know, with the patch notes and stuff like that, um, but I had a couple of days there where I was coughing up blood and stuff. It, it just wasn't pretty, so I just took a couple more days. Uh, but we're here. Looks like we're back. Uh, we're going to be talking about the maintenance today. Uh, the maintenance today is actually really, really important because it involves some key things involving mutator orbs. I still do want to make a video talking about my opinion on the mutations and the dungeons and how that's going to affect the game overall for the future. But that will probably come a little bit later. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this. Uh, Luxandra says, greetings, adventurers. We will be taking downtime today at 1130. Uh, game's still up. You guys probably hear my person, you know, chopping on the stone cutting thing uh, <laughs> in the background, maybe. But he said, uh, they said that, she said, uh, that they fixed an issue which caused player storage sheds being filled with items that are the same, but not stacking properly. Uh, this bug also causes items not to be used in crafting, causing crafts to fail and consume the top resource being used. And this has also been corrected and storage and crafting should be behaving normally. All right. Uh, the next thing is the, the Ring of the Forger Signet, uh, which was improperly removed from the game and players inventories is now earnable in game but will not automatically return to your inventory they're saying that they apologize for the inconvenience and will deliver a made good to return this item outside of a patch to players who had equipped it at any point now this is the most important one okay because you you guys know mutations have been out we've been running mutations like non-stop since the patch yesterday uh, but the big thing here is they fixed a bug that caused loot from the elite chest and the mutated Lazarus instrumentality expeditions uh, to not respect the player's expertise. Um, basically, what that means is while we were doing the dungeons, we were getting a crap ton of 500 gear. Um, 500, 500, 500. We were still getting loot that was respective to our expertise, but there was a lot of gear that we were getting that had nothing to do with anything. And that's what they're addressing. So they're saying that now Elite Chess will drop loot based on the player's expertise values in that mutated expedition. They apologize for this inconvenience and will deliver a make good to return mutator orbs, okay, uh, outside of this patch to players who used them before this change was made. They also addressed a server crash which impacts expeditions and outpost rush. But here's the big thing. The challenge with, uh, well... The blessing is that we're going to get the mutator orbs back because the way that mutators work right now is you can only do basically three per person per week. Um, so you'll basically want to make sure you have a lot of friends or make some friends so you guys can run the mutators as much as possible. Um, why they did this and decided to run it that way where you can only get like a limited amount of mutator orbs per week is beyond me. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, the kicker here, though, is that we don't know when we're going to get our mutator orbs back. So even though they're giving us them back, which is, I think, a good move, um, I wouldn't <laughs> I wouldn't count on them being here soon. Uh, this could be a thing where we might not see the mutator orbs till later this week. And if not later this week, then potentially next week uh, for the actual maintenance and update. So this could mean that next week we'll have a lot more orbs to use, which will be really, really nice. Uh, especially if you guys are trying to punch through the ranks and or farm a crap ton of umbral shards so you guys can upgrade your gear, which we'll talk about in a different video for those of you guys who uh, might have taken a break from New World. But all in all, uh, things are going to be good. So I just wanted to take a little bit of time, um, A, come back to New World and uh, start making videos again since, you know, we're almost over this COVID hump and B, uh, just kind of share this information with you guys because this is actually really, really important as this affects uh, the work that you guys have been putting in and resources that you guys have spent to get your mutator orbs to do this. So anyway, guys, uh, thank you guys so much much for tuning in it feels really really good to be back finally and being able to play video games again if you guys got any questions comments concerns definitely let me know in the comment box below and i'll be happy to assist and we'll see you guys in the next video peace